YouTube. Hey, we back with Solo Minotti and DDG, bro. This video right here is DDG calls the industry on me after getting exposed. This is by Solo Minotti's channel. Just gonna get into it. I'm gonna just, I'm gonna just call and just see. Then they put a rat uh, emoji on this nigga. That's tough. Hello. Hey, I, I got a quick question. Um, yeah, what's up? So this this very mean person made a uh, a YouTube video about me, but he put way too petty as a sound in the video. We can claim it, right? We should be able to, yeah. If you use, if you use the sound, and you know how many how much of the sound he used. Yeah, he used he used a decent amount. I, can't you just do it because it's fair use, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. It should be played by Sony Music. Okay, I'm gonna. Hey, I mean, like he said though, like Soluminati said though, like, I mean, they both can be making claims on each other, like. They both can be making claims on each other. But it's weird. Send you the link after this. So we can make more of a pivot. Alright, okay. I love you. Yeah, send me the link. Alright. Okay, bye. Uh, uh, he just got the biggest views of his life. I'm finna take it away. Uh. Now listen. And he used way too petty nature, so in the building. Gang, sir. Gang, sir. In the building, man. Simple. Hey, listen. This man, some way, somehow, I dropped a video talking about his girl. I dropped a video talking about him, him as a person. And some way, somehow, he made the entire thing steal, like I told y'all, about money. It's either money, jewelry, car, clothes. Which one is it? Motherfucker sprinklers turned on while I was out here trying to go crazy high vibrations good energy but listen it come to a point he can't even respond notice he called the industry and he asked them can you please take the video down or can i please make money off the vid do you notice out of everything i said about him exposed him i cussed i said disney exposed all type of shit in the vid if you reacted to the vid you notice it wasn't monetized it was no ads on the vid <laughs> There was no ads on the bid. It was no ads on the bid to begin with. For the viewer that don't know, this is my third channel. I'm not doing none of this for the money. The video was demonetized. I couldn't get paid for it anyway. All my videos get demonetized, just like my second channel. Look, this is all the videos. Some of us don't do this shit for money. Some of us actually come on here and expose. That's crazy. Hey, what King Von say to score like six to twenty-four? Hey, that's crazy. Exposing shit, man. You get what I'm saying? And when niggas come on here exposing shit, people like doodle garbage can only bring up money. He got to call the industry and stuff. Man, this is the 48 Laws of Power. I could literally take all his fans right now. He's, bro, he's, he's empty. He can't help nobody with mental health. He can't help nobody with depression. He'll probably just tell him, go get some money. He has no genuine connection with anybody, bro. I told y'all, this nigga, <laughs> everybody see it now. The only thing he could think about was money. Bro, how was you so vulnerable and bothered by a motherfucker dropping videos on his third channel with 200,000 subscribers? Yeah, that's what I was trying to tell y'all, bro. <clears throat> this right here is what I was trying to tell y'all, bro. He was trying to say, like, yeah, he don't got no uh, clout, woo-woo. Bro, Solomonati posted on his main channel. Bro, those videos are going trending. If he posts on his main channel, them videos are going trending. The videos that he posted on his third channel is getting 100,000 views. Hundreds of thousands of views on his third channel. If he posts on his first channel, come on, bro. Like, his fan base ain't go, go nowhere. And it's obviously, we, we're happy to see that he's back. If he posts on that first channel, come on, bro. It's through the roof. Like, stop it, bro. And you have four million.
this nigga, hey, like, I seen a comment saying, like, bro, this nigga just naturally funny, bro. Like, he don't even got to try, bro. That, for real, bro. This nigga's just hilarious, bro. Bro, you really should retire. Bro, DDG, you not fucking with this nigga, bro. I'm sorry to tell you, bro. Just because you make music and shit like that, bro, you're not funnier than him. Like, you have no sayings. Nobody, nobody ever wanted to talk like you. You don't have no lingo. Man. None of that shit, bro. This nigga so Illuminati started so many trends on this YouTube shit. To show to your motherfucking fridge protector. Plate cleaner. Motherfucking. Like, come on, bro. Like, you just not fucking with this nigga in no way, shape, or form, bro. I'm sorry to tell you. Yo, fans see you for what you are. These little niggas getting older. None of that jury and shit don't matter. They getting smarter. They yeah, like, bro, facts. this nigga broke his feet. Broke spiritually. He really broke his hell for real. He has nothing to offer for nothing. Nah, for real. Like, everybody back in the back in the day that had them, like, family channels and shit like that, like, niggas don't want to see that shit no more, bro. That shit was played out back then, like, two years later. Niggas say, oh, man, niggas, females not watching none of that shit. Like, niggas don't give a fuck about none of that, man. Nothing. All he can do is tell. But, hey, I rest my case. Everything I said has come true. Everything I said, the first thing he could think about was money. On a video that wasn't making no money in the first place. I'm glad y'all got a chance to watch it with no ads. Like majority of all my other vids. I cuss in every video, my nigga, it's not possible. I'm talking about selling soul and all this different shit. You think they really gonna pay me for this? That's tough. But, hey, make sure you like, share, subscribe if you're new. And I'm out, bruh. So...